Here we go. Lock with the missile. Engage. Tone. Fox two. Tracking. Whoa! Hoo, hoo, hoo. Man, Gaijin's Christmas hangar looks really good this year. Good work. Good afternoon, you wee bastards, and welcome back to War Thunder with Koala. And today, as promised, for the first time, we are flying out the supersonic jets in War Thunder. MiG-19 PT, the farmer, top speed, 1,397 kilometers per hour. Yeah, I'm going to enjoy today. Let's all just sit back for a moment and take into account that we finally, after how many years, we have tier 6 jets in the game. I mean, raise your hands if you'd given up hope. If you're a jet pilot or just an ARB pilot, raise your hands if you'd given up hope that Gaijin would uh, put more development work into air battles. But now, well, you can't say that anymore, can you? Here it is. MiG-19, we've got the F-100, which we'll take out at some point this week, I'm sure. We've got the Javelin, which I might save till after Christmas. Ah. <sighs> Tier 6 jets. Wait, you guys know what this means, right? Next update, F-4 Phantom, MiG-21, Hunter F-6, we've got the, the Mystery 4, the Super Mystery, the Mirage, F-8 Crusader. All the way up to the modern day. We, it, the groundwork is here now. This is the first steps. And we've taken them. Now, the MiG-19 is... Oh. This is the best of the bunch. I will say that straight away. For air battles, for PvP, this is the best of the three Tier 6 jets we have so far. We have insanely high energy retention compared to the F-100. And the Javelin will... That thing's not even supersonic. Let's just not count that for now. We have a very good roll rate. We have insane acceleration. And our climb rate is through the roof. 140 meters per second. We've also got our two... Heat-seeking air-to-air guided missiles. What? I... I mean... Dev server was out and, and dev blogs and patch notes were out ages ago, but uh, pending that, I didn't think we'd he I didn't think we'd get here. I didn't think this would happen, not yet. But it is. I mean, look at them. Oh wow. Now I'm gonna save my whole thoughts on the meta of jets and and the roles of supersonic jets, how they function. I'm gonna save all that for another video. We're just gonna go have some fun in the MiG-19, get some games, and uh, see what this baby can do. This is my, gonna be my first time playing it. I've not played it at all. I wanted the kind of first impressions, and uh, yeah, that's what this is gonna be. I'm excited as hell. Tier six jets. I've been waiting for this for a very long time. So without further ado, lads, let's go. Oh my god, listen to that afterburner. Alright, this is going to be a good day. Alright, we are full afterburner. Oh, this looks nice. Well done to the Russians for designing good cockpits. Like, damn, these MiGs, they look good. Alright, full afterburner takeoff, 300 kilometers an hour already. And come on, up we go, you heavy thing. Wow, we took off late. <laughs> and we are catching this MiG-15 like he is standing still. Uh, oh. Wow. Can we all just take a minute to appreciate that Gaijin actually did this? My god. Hey, man. How are you doing? <laughs> this is going to be a fun day. I'm having to yell over this afterburner. We are just casually approaching Mark 1 in a straight line and on the deck. That effect is really quite overpowering, guys, and I think you need to lower that a lot. <laughs> Can't quite hit uh, Mark 1 in the straight line with the missiles attached. All right, we've got an F-86 Sabre incoming. Head on. Oh, 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 
Okay. <laughs> First target down. Splash one. Um, yeah, nice. We've got another one here. Can we try it again? It doesn't look like he wants... No, no, no sauce. These guns really aren't that difficult to lead. Oh, and we're, we're, we're bugging out. Oh, he's got no chance. Bye. <laughs> and there's that effect. See, that, it shouldn't get any bigger than that. It should not get any bigger than that. That gaijin, it's really cool, but please lessen it a bit so that we can actually see what's in front of our plane. All right, what's going on here? Tons of Sabres, haven't seen any F-100 yet. They're our targets, our priorities, if we see them. I think we might have a shot on this FG-4 here. Oh, nice, MiG-19. Damn. Okay, plenty of Sabres here. This F-86A5 is probably our uh, easiest bet right now. Oh, maybe this guy. We're on your six, man. What are you going to do about it? Missile? Fire? Or fox shoot? Ah, oh, it's not going to track. God, that sounds cool to be seen in War Thunder. Fox 2. We're here, lads. Missiles in. Oh. Ah, I just missed that guy. Was that early or late? I'm still learning these guns. These are new guns. I have to kind of relearn how to aim them in that kind of engagement. We might have a missile kill here. Ah, oh, he's turning too sharply. I wouldn't be at it. Oh, just a little bit too far right on those shots. Oh, he's going up. Come on. Ah, oh, this thing's a bit too heavy for those kind of shots. If I was in a Sabre or a MiG-17, say... Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is not how you should use a MiG-19, guys. This is not at all how you should... He's coming back around. He's going to outturn me. Yeah, if I was in a MiG-17 or something, this guy would be long dead already. And... Yeah, no, no chance. Gonna... No, okay, we're gonna egress... Extend and we're disengaged. He's got my god. By the time we've recovered from the stall, and he has recovered from the stall, we're already going 700 kph, whereas he's at like 300. These jets aren't a huge amount faster than our regular old 9.0s, but they accelerate so much harder and they retain energy so much better, at least in a straight line. Of course, the F-100, as soon as you make a single turn, you lose about 600 kph airspeed, and that, mm. The MiG-19, th this is the better of the two. I can tell you that right now. No ordnance on this thing, though. No use in ground battles. Unless you go an anti-fighter or anti-helicopter. That's not really the most useful these days. Missile. He'll evade it if he's smart, but at least we can get him to turn, kind of lessen his energy. Come on, I need the rudder to work here. And I know the rudder on this plane is not great. Nah, see. This plane locks up. I mean, the ailerons are fine, and the, the elevator is fine, but the rudder at high speeds locks up so much. Oh! Actually, we're gonna head back around over. Haven't got many rounds left for our guns. I have no missiles. No, nah, no chance there. We're going to go back around. Merge. And accelerate. Afterburner. Oh. No. Whoa. He almost pegged us then. Okay, we are catching this F Saber like it's nothing. I can't make that turn, can I? Oh, yes, maybe. Hold fire. Hold fire. Uh, okay, maybe we should have taken that shot, actually. Don't black out. Ah. Go, you need good pilots to fly these things. Hmm, almost. A little bit low on the shots. 42 rounds left.
Maybe, maybe. Oh, you lucky little son of a bitch. He saw me at the last second there. Okay, only a couple left. I wonder if we can catch this guy before he gets back to base. He looks like he's going back to his airfield. 11.50. There's that sonic boom. We got someone on our sixth, but I don't think... No, he's got no chance of catching us. 120. One kilometer. Oh, I've only... I still had a missile right now. Okay, I'm pulling off that. I don't want to... Nah, if he wants to go back to base, we'll let him. Where's this other saber? Oh, there he is. He's got absolutely no chance of catching me. The thing is, in a 1v1, there's nothing I can do to him either. If he's at all smart. He can evade my shell so easily because this plane... This is like a Voltor compared to him. <laughs> and you guys know, if you use the Voltor 2A as a fighter... In a 1v1, there's not much you can do besides head on. All I'm doing is extending upwards. He has no chance of beating out this climb rate, no matter how much energy he has. Maybe if we go down? See, all I have to do to remain safe from him is just go up. Yeah, and that's it. And then we dive away. The thing is, what am I going to do when I catch up to him? He can just roll, he can outturn me, he can outroll me. This plane is so big and heavy compared to him, this is not built to fight little jets like that. See, why can I not see him right now? I, I, I can clearly see his plane, he's right there on my screen, he's about a kilometer away from me, but he's not spotted. Why? How is it that you get a, a warning when a, uh, a heat-seeking missile is coming? Something that real planes do not have. You can't get a warning when a heat-seeker is coming for you. At least not in older planes like this. But I get a warning when the missile is coming, but I, I, I can't spot the saber that's about a kilometer away. I can clearly see him. Gaijin, we really need to increase the spotting distance here. Especially, I mean, for all jets, let alone for these jets. This is ridiculous. He's right here. There we go. At 1.3, he pops in. And it's already too late for me to correct my engagement. Oh boy. Oh boy, this is dangerous. Oh god. And... Nope. Egress out. He's got no chance of catching me. God, take a shot every time I say no chance and... Wow. No, I, <clears throat> I, kids, don't, don't do that. All I have to do is this, and he can't catch me, but it doesn't matter anyway, because I can't do anything to him. Actually, we are stalling right now. He might get a shot on me here. I have no teammates. God, we're so high up so quickly. See, by the time he pops in, it, it's almost too late already. Nah, I, I can't. I can't turn with him. He he can outturn me so easily. I mean, this is like a Voltor trying to fight a Mig 15. It's it's not gonna or a Mig 17. It's not gonna work. Oh dear! Don't pull off that turn. He's stalling. No, we're good. He's he's in a full stall right there. Run, come back, try again. I guess that's the gameplay in these things. Alright, so it's a little bit later in the game. We do have a little bit of team support from some MiG-17s now, which is good. I'm still the least effective plane to be in out of the three of us for actually killing these guys. But I'm probably safest from them at the same time. Okay, there's that boom. Come on, get it off my screen. I can't see him. I can't see what he's doing. Nah, he's evaded us. Guys, ah, so easy for them. But at the same time, they, there's nothing they can do to me either. 
Okay, we got the MiG-17 coming in for this guy at the same time. If we can bait him into turning, the MiG-17 can probably take him out. Now we're back to chasing him back to his base. Go on, man, stop running! <laughs> I know you're not out of ammo or fuel. Come on. Don't want to overuse my afterburner. My engine's cooking a bit right now. Possibly here. No. Oh, almost made that, actually. We really don't turn too badly. I mean, I compared it to the Voltor. It is more maneuverable than the Voltor. That's for sure. Just chasing these guys down. And we're so close to their base, I don't want to... No. None of those bloody radar-guided AA guns should be able to hit me. So when are we getting uh, surface-to-air missiles, Gaijin? Oh. Might have another head on here. Only 12 rounds left. They're going to try it. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. GG, guys. <laughs> I have absolutely no chance of turning for this guy. Fuck! <laughs> god damn it. I have done that so many times in this plane. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh, point mark point nine nine, and I wasn't even beginning to get that effect just then. I guess the air is too hot for it. That's really cool that guy just implemented that. All right, F one hundred super saber boys. Here we go. What are you doing, man? Ooh. That felt good. <laughs> that was good. We got this saber right here. I might go for a missile up. Come on. Oh. Oh, the rudder. There we go. Oh, oh I pressed the wrong button. God, it's weird having these different key bindings all of a sudden. Gotta get used to it. Come on, lock him up. Fire. I can't fire too many Gs. Nah, the rudder's not good enough to put that shot in. Okay, afterburner on. And we're away. Alright, merging. We've got to save our friendly. Well, that guy's going up. We're going to stay on the front. Come on, lock him up. Fire. And fox shoot. Ah, no, there he goes. See, that's how you use your missiles. Make them evade, and you can put them in a bad position. Oh, how did that not hit him? Once again, I'm still learning these guns. They're still new to me, so expect me to make some bad shots compared to them. Ah, I don't want to fire just then. My god, the sound effects are amazing. Almost got him there. We'll try again. Okay, going for the re-engage. Come on, I want a missile kill. We have to get at least one. Load factor too high. There we go. It's all right. He's going to evade it. Yep. He's slow, though. We might be able to get him here. We've only got a couple of rounds left. Ah. Uh, no, nah, not enough now. I'm going back to base. Ooh. Yep, no. He's wow. Okay, we have a lot of team support this time. Oh, he's... Yeah, he's done for. Alright, we're on final approach. Extremely fast for final approach on a runway like this, but uh, perform some spastic maneuvers, fire off the rest of our rounds. Let's see how difficult it is to land this thing. 
Oh, really not difficult at all. I was expecting this to absolutely fall out of the sky at 300, but no, it, it still handles pretty well. I wonder if the Super Saber will be any different. Or the Javelin as well, that thing. <sighs> Alright, well, good landing. I don't think we're going to make it back up again. Night battle. Okay, this is interesting. Oh, wow. This looks fantastic. Can we close the lid? Oh, I'm having fun here. Okay, take a flat side. Uh, accelerating past 200 kilometers an hour. Wow, that afterburner sound. Okay, I don't know where the land is, so I'm gonna elevate pretty quickly, actually. Okay, Super Saber just killed a MiG-17 over here. I'm gonna put afterburner on and see if we can get over here. There he is. He's coming right for me. Ah, uh, not quite. Oh, a little bit. Almost. Is he going to keep turning? Come on, we've got teammates coming in from behind. Yes, nice work. Well done. Okay, Super Saber down. What? Is, why is there an XP-38 in here? Okay, let's see if we can lock up the Saber. There's the FJ-4 on our Meg as well. Oh, there's this Saber down low as well. I might change targets. Load factor too high. Oh, it's, I still can't launch. I couldn't launch. Okay, we're coming right in low altitude here. This is dangerous. Come on. No, I couldn't quite. See, you can't correct your aim well enough at close range. There's a super saver here. We might have a shot. Yes. Right. Oh, a little bit behind, I think. There he goes. Got two of them. I'm going to focus on this one here. I don't think he knows I'm here. He's tunnel vision on this MiG-17. Okay, here we go for missile kill. But not yet, not yet. Not yet. Correct. Fire. Go. Hey, there we go. We got it, boys. Missiles away. <laughs> First ever kill with air to air missiles in War Thunder. Oh, wow. That felt good. Did anyone notice, though? Have we got the achievement unguided? <laughs> Guys, I think you need to remove that. Alright, here we go. This saber here. Oh, come on, I can barely see him through that effect. Hey, nice kill. Oh, maybe this one as well. Oh, I can't turn for him. Oh, we've got enemies on my six. Maybe I can risk this guy, though. on. Ah, almost. Okay. Egressing out. Disengaged. Up we go. Oh, maybe this guy here is in a stall. Got him critical. Feel like that should have killed him, actually. Oh, never mind. Things are happening. We've got to dodge this F-35. <laughs> F-35 Sabre, not F-35 Lightning. <laughs> One day, Gaijin. One day. Hey, there goes that Sabre we created earlier. That's two. Hey, wow. Nice. Maybe again. Nope, nothing there. Oh, he put a couple into me, though. They're not too heavily damaged, that's alright. Hey, Dollar! I think we got a little bit too overconfident there. 
Could even create short. Nope. I think this is the end for. Uh, since when do I only have one engine working? Haha! <laughs> 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 oh, oh boy, we cannot fly on one engine. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. This is bad. This is bad. I think we're going down here, lads. Oh, no. I... Three kills. That's not too bad. Bring it, Super Saber. Uh, oh, oh. <laughs> Did he just rip? Oh, the Meg got him. Nice. Disengaging from everyone right now. Oh, where did you come from? <laughs> wow, who do we pick? I think this... Oh, no, that F-34 has got like a 5 on him. Alright. Just Sabres. Maybe that Hunter over there? Maybe the saber down here. I want a missile kill. Here we go. Locking up. Are we going to get him? No, he just pulled inside of that one. Ah, damn rudder on this plane. Guys, if you're facing MiG-19s, abuse that rudder. That's the only advice I've got for you. No, he's moving too spastically. I can't lock him. Not good enough. I'm not wasting this last missile. Nah. Couldn't... Whoa! Oh, oh, oh. oh, that was a bit too close. Watch where you're flying, man. Oh, yeah. Come on. No, he sees me. Might still have a shot. If he keeps that turn up. No, there he goes. I think we might stay with him here, actually. Nice to... He just put air brakes on. Okay, we're going to take ours. Yep. Oh, jeez. Yeah, we're going to... Get our air brakes in and get out of here. So easy when they're that slow. We accelerate the pants out of him. <laughs> take him out. No, he's missed. Okay, it's our turn. Um, back down. Here we go. Lock with the missile. Engage. Tone. Fox 2. Tracking. Whoa! Woo -hoo -hoo! Tango down and unguided. <laughs> wow, so we didn't even get close to a direct hit there. That was splash damage. Wow. Uh, mm. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. <laughs> Good missile kill. And that's the game. Whoa, Gaijin. Great work on tier 6 jets so far. I do think every nation should have gotten them, but uh, oh, you can't deny. This was incredible fun, and my god, what a time to be playing War Thunder. I am so happy with the way Tier 6 Jets have come out right now. For an ARRB player that's been waiting for this for years, and I'm sure there's many others of you out there that are going to be very happy with this. And please let me know your thoughts on Tier 6 Jets in the comment section below. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video, lads. I really hope you have enjoyed because I've had an absolute blast today. This is so much fun, exploring what these jets can do. It's going to take me a lot of time, and it's going to take the meta a few weeks to kind of settle down. But uh, after that, we're going to really be sinking our teeth into this. And next update, MiG-21s, Mysteri 4A, Mirage, Mitsubishi F1, I mean, F8 Crusader, they're all possible now. Once again, like if you enjoyed this video, lads. Subscribe if you haven't already. We're about to hit 10,000 by the end of the year. I really think we could do it. 
and uh, come follow me at all the social media links in the description below. I'm going to be going away over the Christmas period, so there will be a gap between uploads. I do apologize for that. There may be something in between that I can put up for you lads. I will try and be back as soon as possible, probably on about the 3rd of January, but uh, I'm sure many of you other lads are going away for over the Christmas period as well, so yeah, that's what's going to happen. We're definitely going to explore some more of the Italian tanks, maybe some naval forces, and uh, I've got so many videos to make on these tier 6 jets, it's not even funny, my schedule is packed. Remember lads, if you'd like to support the channel, my Patreon link is in the video description below, I'm not going to go through the whole speech, this video has been long enough already. Anyway, until next time lads, always remember, keep your bagpipes to hand, keep your kilt on, and I shall see you next video. I see a wee thank you to these lads for supporting me on Patreon. DA261, Latvian Wolf, Geesley Gadarsen, and Dark Recon, you lads abroad. If you wish to join them, come check out the link in the description below.